All right, um, it's 10 a.m. Just woke up. We got a new season trailer to react to. I'm sorry, I've been doing way too much reaction content on the channel. I know it's like a, a lazy form of content. Um, I'm going to be going to Genesis X this weekend. It's a big LAN. You, know, you got Smash, you got a bunch of other fighting games. Of course, you've got Splatoon, and that's going to be my, my main focus. I'm going to be vlogging there and hopefully getting some of that done. And something, you know, just not as lazy as reaction content. I'm, I've am i been really busy with college and stuff, so I don't really have time to make any videos, but I still want to put something out there it's just so I can get some activity on the channel. But anyway, um, enough with that. Um, fresh season 2024. Let's see what we got. Ooh, an airport map. Okay. I like that. In Sunshine Airport. Is that a Mario Kart 8 reference? Oh, here comes the plane. Okay. Ooh, swing a splash down. I saw the two deco and I am not happy. Hopefully it has a garbage kick. Give like a marker and screen. <laughs> I fucking hate 52. Marlin Airport. Okay. I hope the map's good. Oh it has It has the pop up. It's like an entry games too. New Brella. Recycled Brella. Oh, that shit's very fragile. And it moves fast. Okay, that's interesting. Off the hook plane. The lesbian plane. <laughs> Dowser Dooley's. It has long range, it looks like. It's, I think it's like maneuver long. That's something you leave with beacon. Okay. Something has wall. And it has suction bomb. Oh, it's pretty flings in. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Bone Rattle Arena. Oh my god, that looks so cool. It has ink rails. The map looks so cool, though. What the hell? Bro, what are those? Is that a new mode? New Splatfest mode? New Splatfest feature, Fizzbang. They, they added flash base to the game. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, that was it? Wait, what? Oh, side order. Yeah, of course. I can't wait to play this, man. <laughs> that looks so good. There's also a, um, a side order trailer, but I don't know if I'll react to that. Oh, hi, Pearl. <laughs> Pearl in the flesh. Okay. Is that the Grisco Charger? <laughs> we got the bow. God, I, I can't wait to play that. It looks so fun. It looks so good. Alright, uh, let's do a quick analysis. Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go back to the beginning here. We got the airport. Uh, something has splashed on. I did not see what that was. Okay, wait, wait, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back, go back. Go back, comma, 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 comma. <laughs> Even Splasher splashed out. Welcome back, Splatoon 2 Vanilla Hydra. <laughs> they give it splash. I want it like crab. You know, that would have been cool, but now they- <laughs> Oh my god. I it looks like they at least buff Splashdown. It's got these explosions here. But... Why? <laughs> it's so dumb. There we go, new Squiffer. Uh, that was like Dread. 52 Deco, Flingza. Custom Me Leader. Wait, the, don't tell me these are like the only... Don't think we're only going to get nine weapons this season, it's just these seven. And then the new Julian. Oh my god, why? 
Bro, come on. Yeah, I don't think we're gonna get third kits. It's gonna be the next thing's gonna be if um what's what's missing? Range blaster, Nautilus, Bamboo, um Edit, Hydra. They gotta make new kits for the new Dooley and the Brellas. That's seven. And then we're gonna get the new um Splatana and Stringer, which which is nine. And then I guess their second kits, which would be eleven, although they've never actually released like their second kits in the same update. So maybe that's copium for a content extension with they add the, the second kits for the new Splatana and Bow, but I don't know, it's not looking good. <laughs> Uh, also the King Flip Mesh hat is back. I miss this hat so much. I love this hat. <laughs> King Flip Mesh, my beloved. The new map. I want to look at this. We get like a whole, a nice spawning area right here. Actually, no, it's probably not this part. Probably like this part is your spawn platform. And the rail goes over to this part over here. We need to get a better shot of that. We got some ink rails. We got the propeller platform. It's literally like anchovy 2. Oh my god, you can die to propeller ink again. <laughs> I just realized you can die to the propeller ink again in this game. Nice. I wonder if we can splash down cancel someone with that. I did that in Splatoon 2, like, miraculously. It was so funny. Um... We got Alice like some sub up in lines here, maybe. Let's see what they got. Yeah, the Brella. Um, that's like forty percent, maybe forty-five. It could be marker, point sensor, or burst bomb. I, actually, I, I don't, I don't think it's burst bomb because if it was, that's that was like more like forty. I forgot to. Oh my god, I had the fucking thing set on forty the whole damn time. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Oh, this is so scuffed. What is it not scuffed? It's always been scuffed. Um, no, that's 40%. Yeah, yeah. I don't think it's going to be Burst Bomb because um, Burst Bomb has worse uh, scaling with Sub Saver. So if you have like one main of Sub Saver, it's not going to go down to 40%. And I uh, know. Is this a, a subsaver jacket? No, I think this is like special charge. I think it's like the Zapfish satin jacket that has special charge on it by default. I'm such a fucking nerd. <laughs> um, Recycle Bro 24 Mark 1. I, I see, yeah, that, that, that part is a bamboozler. <laughs> That's funny. It fires off the Brella. Um, it breaks really fast, it looks like, but it also moves fast. I don't know. Th this seems like 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 shitty tent umbrella, if you ask me. Like it it it's tent umbrella, but fast and also like a lot weaker. I don't know about this one. Especially given the fact it has marker or point sensor. I don't know. Uh fifty two here has what looks to be sixty five percent. So I'm guessing that's either going to be curling, which would make sense given that it's had curling in the past in Splatoon 2, and also Seeker in Splatoon 1. So, it's probably going to be that, and I don't know what else I could give it. Give it, like, something garbage, like, screen. I don't know. I, I, fuck 52. <laughs> it could also have Torp, which I hope it doesn't, because, again, fuck 52. I don't know. Like, what's like the damage by one? Like, it's very like high damage to make up for that awful shield, right? Let's see, that's like one. I don't know. Two shots pretty standard for Brella, right? Wait, was that three shots? That could have been three shots. No, he, maybe, like, he, maybe he like took damage from like the enemy ink here. I don't know. But, one. Well, actually, no, the, the, did that first shot miss? No, the first should definitely hit. One, two. It looks like, I don't know. Yuri played this. <laughs> the new Dooleys. Yeah, the, it has long range. 
that like outranges the the Squiffer here. So that's gonna be like the maneuver long that was data mined. I guess that's what it was referring to the, the long range. I was hoping for long dodge rolls, but no, we got like jet sculpture range in this one pretty much. It's pretty interesting. It's good. Decent fire rate looks like. Actually, no, that doesn't sound very decent. It sounds pretty middling. But then when you dodge roll, that's when it gets really good. Yeah, that's what it seems like. Oh, wait! You have less range when you dodge roll. You see that? Like, he completes the dodge roll animation here, and then you get the reticle. Yeah, you have less range when you roll, but the fire rate increases. Okay, that's... That's really interesting. Hmm. I want to see a sub-weapon line. Do we have that? Uh, we can kind of have it, like, right here. That's, like... That's, like, 55%? Or was it 60? It could be either, like, auto bomb. If it's 55, and then if it's 60, it can be like marker, not a marker, oops, mine, um, fizzy. It could be a lot of things with 50%, with um, 60%, rather, excuse me. I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll have to see about that. Mid looks, the middle of the map looks really, like, flat and open. Well, I can see, like, you have, like, these things to kind of raise up, but I don't know, a little bit more cover could be nice, but at the same time, it's like, this is like your main stabbing perch, it looks like, over here is on great, so... I don't know. We need a better look at it. We need a better look at it. Yeah, you got custom elite with beacons. Of course. Oh, the White King tank is back. Nice. I'm assuming, like, the... The Splatoon 2 promotional girl... Um, her entire fit's back in this season. Right? Yeah, flings it with suction. Uh, we see Squiffer here, before it, he dies. Go back. That looks like 55%. It's probably going to be Autobomb. It's had Autobomb in Splatoon 2, so I can definitely see that. The new Emerald... <laughs> These inkable walls. I love inkable walls. <laughs> the ink rail. Yeah, the new. They, get, they added flashbacks to the game. <laughs> um, Splatfest definitely needed something to shake it up a little bit. I've got so bored of Splatfest. Like during the Frosty Fest, I only got to, like Ruler Plus Two. Like I did not play it that much. I just did not care in the slightest. Um. It probably didn't help to also play Persona 5 at the time, but, you know. <laughs> I just really did not feel like playing that one too much. Actually, was Frosty Fest during when I was also playing Persona? I don't remember. <laughs> was it, like, in the middle of January? I don't know. Yeah, Flashbangs does chip damage, it's like, too. And then, yeah, you got that. The song's interesting. Okay, we got a big overview of the map here. Check out if I can have too many explosions. Okay, uh... Let's see, you have your spawn here, you get an ingrow over to this high ground over here. It looks like defending on tower control might finally not be miserable. It depends on how they put the tower path, but you have, like, a lot of high ground to work with. This map looks pretty good in the spawn area. I, I like that. Mid is kind of flat and empty. Um, you have like some cover here with these walls and the, the block. But yeah. Um, kind of empty over here. You got your propeller platform as like a flank, it looks like, kind of. I mean, you can, oh, you can like drop down to here. Okay, that's pretty good. You can drop into like this little area, this like little side part here, kind of come up, maybe. That looks pretty good. I like that. Um, can you... It's so hard. It's so hard to tell, but... Like, this here... How do you go from, like, the side, like, into... 
This is like elevated, it looks like. Yeah, it's like mid, it's like elevated, and you got like the, the things kind of going up to it, but. Is this wall inkable? Please tell me this wall is inkable. It's probably not inkable, is it? I don't see anything that suggests the wall to be inkable. God damn it. We were so close to greatness. Make, make, make this little quarter right here inkable. You know, you can't come up here. Like, come on. Oh my god. It looks like your only inkable walls are like the middle block, this thing here, and then the, like the walls of the propeller platforms, and that's kind of about it. We still don't have too many inkable walls in the maps, aside from Salmon Run, but... Oh wait! I... They only shut off one new map in this trailer. Oh. Hmm. Oh, uh, hmm, mm. Given that this is a Splatoon 2 themed update, right? You got the side order. Actually, no, I mean, side order is part of chill season, technically, because it's coming out before the new season drops. They advertise it in the fresh season trailer, so maybe they consider it to be part of this as well? I don't know, but... You have that, you get the new Dooley, the new Brill, you get the Splatoon 2 promo girl gear. Um, maybe this is Copium, but maybe we'll see a Splatoon 2 th map returning that they're getting out on Twitter later. I haven't checked Twitter yet, by the way. This is just speculation. Maybe there's like some weapon kits they posted there or something. I don't fucking know, but... Uh, only one new map, and only nine weapons. Hmm. That's kind of disappointing, to be honest, but honestly, what's new at this point? They... <laughs> what is new at this point? At least the map looks pretty good. I, I like this so far. This is this is pretty good. Good good spawn platform. You can drop down into the side here, and you kind of get into mid, or maybe like, can you? Yeah, like this this whole thing here, like, can you like get onto the propeller platform from here? Maybe can you climb that? Uh, it's so hard to tell because of the fucking ink making everything. Is there, like, a better shot of it over here somewhere that I can look at? No, no, the, the propeller platform is like, is, like, is, like, flat with mid. It's, like, on the same elevation as mid. Okay. Yeah, I, you can drop it into, into, into like the low side area down here, but how, how do you get into mid from that part? It's, surely one of these walls has to be inkable, right? Or does it go to the block or something? I don't, I don't know. I'm, <laughs> uh, either way, uh, I'm really excited for side order. I think I'll wrap up the, the uh, thing. How much am I recording for? Oh my fucking god, almost nine, almost 20 minutes. Um, Yeah, I'll wrap things up here. Um, really, really excited for side order. I don't think I'll react to the overview trailer because I probably won't be saying much in that one because I'm going to be listening to the guy talk and then I don't want to analyze it too much. I want to go in. I don't want to analyze the side order too much. I want to see what's like myself firsthand. Um, so that's going to do it for me. I'm really excited for side order. I can't wait to play that. And then as for the season itself, I mean, it's... Kinda underwhelming, but at least the map looks pretty good and the song is nice. Hopefully there's more stuff they're gonna reveal that wasn't in this tree. Like, oh, we're gonna add a bunch of new gear pieces, finally, and not just have the only new gear be available in the catalog. But time will tell, I guess. Barely any new weapons, only one new map. And not many new gear pieces, maybe. I don't know. It, it seems like your average Splatoon 3 season at this point, but
Hey, at least we got a side order to keep us busy. So, there's going to be that. I hit the 20 minute mark. I've been. Well. <laughs> anyway, I'll see you guys later. We're going to be doing some side order streams on this channel. Can't wait for that.